Hey everyone, I just got an email uh, that came in a couple hours ago and it was from a customer. And as you can see right here, it says, Hey James, I purchased your insider's guide to retargeting on Facebook a while back and I'm finally putting it to use. It looks like Facebook has done some updates since this guide was written and I've been able to get everything set except the exclude audience setting. I can't seem to find it anywhere. Can you point me in the right direction? Thanks so much. So I will have to double check that and probably update the report with some new screenshots. So what I want to do in this video is at least just show you how to do this because I'm sure if Tara has this question, I'm sure there could be some other people out there that have the same question as well. So I'm making this quick video for you. So if you go into your ads manager, up here in the very top corner, you'll see create an ad. So you click create ad, you go ahead and choose your objective. We're just going to do uh, send people to your website for this example. And then we're going to come down here and you'll see right here. Now this will look the same whether you're using ads manager or power editor once you get to the create your ad set, because that's where you actually set your audiences when you're creating an ad set. So right here in custom audiences, if I click here and select, let's say I want to put an ad in front of my leads and in front of people who have hit the squeeze page, but I want to exclude customers. So I would click on customers and then you'll notice here when you hover over this, you'll see this little gray drop down. If you click that, come down here and you'll see an option to exclude. So highlight exclude this audience, click it. And now this ad will be shown to the leads squeeze page hits, but it will exclude customers. So that's how they've done it. They've kind of hidden it away. Now, same idea here. If I pull this down for exclude and then I just uncheck it, then it would be included. So that's how you go ahead and include and exclude your custom audiences in when you're creating your ad sets. So I hope this, I hope this was helpful. I hope it solved your problem. And if any of you watching this have a question or I'm thinking of actually starting a, you know, ask James type thing where you guys just submit your questions about the power editor or, or creating ads or bidding or anything like that. Uh, so I can just continue, continue to create uh, content on a weekly basis. Sometimes, as you know, if you're out there creating content, it's, uh, you know, you, you're not sure what to create all the time because, you know, you just don't know unless you ask people. So um, I'm thinking about sending out an email here in a, in a week or so asking you guys uh, just to respond to the email or fill out a quick form uh, so I can create more quick little videos like this showing you how to actually accomplish small little, you know, how to stuff within the ads manager or power editor. So if you have a question right now that you want to answer, just leave a comment below this video and um, I'll see you in the next one.